You're watching East Texas Live. Welcome back into East Texas Live here on KETK. Our friends from the city of Tyler here, and we are talking about all things Liberty Hall this morning, and we've got some pretty exciting things lined up in the works. That's right, we do. So we're getting up into our September show. Mm -hmm. So starting first, we have Elvis Meets the Beatles, and that's happening September 11th at 5 p.m. That's a Sunday, so mark your calendars. We're going to be having a New Zealand Elvis, Brendan Chase, joining okay. us. He has competed in several competitions across the world and won many of them, so we're really excited to have him join us on stage at Liberty Hall. And then for the Beatles, we have Beatlemania 64. They've been to Liberty before. They always put on a great show for us, so we're really excited to have these two performances is together for Elvis meets the Beatles. And so you're telling me this Elvis has competed across or performed across the world. Yes. And so he must be really a really good Elvis in person. Oh, he is great. And if you want to see a little sneak peek, you can go to our Facebook page, Liberty Hall, and we do have a little video. It's just of him talking, but mm -hmm. it does show some of his uh, previous performances that he's done, and he is phenomenal. It's definitely going to be what people are wanting to see from the costumes, the dance moves from both Elvis and our Beatlemania 64. Oh, yeah, especially with the new Elvis movie coming out. Like, yes. if you went and watched that, you love it. Per perfect opportunity. That's right. It's and a get great to come time. See the close, and close to the real thing, I guess. That's right. Anyway. That's right. But hey, like I said, he's won many competitions. Oh, yes. So he's. We've heard some great things about people being excited to see him at Liberty Hall. Well, I'm excited. Okay, what do we got after that? So then after that, we have The Greatest Showman, classic movie, but we're going to be showing the 2017 version. It's going to be a sing-along, so we're encouraging people to come out and sing their favorite songs. The Greatest Showman tells the story of... Uh, Oh, I just lost his name. I'm so sorry. <laughs> but he's the founder of the Ringling Brothers and uh -huh. Barnum and Bailey Circuses. And so it, it's going to be a great time. And we're really hoping that we get, you know, some people that maybe want to go ahead and dress up. We know Halloween is creeping up on us. So if you want to dress up for the greatest showman, please do come out and sing your favorite songs. Okay, well, I'm a little embarrassed to admit. I have not yet seen The Greatest Showman, and I love musicals, so I don't know why I haven't done it. It's on my list. I think someone just gasped in my ear uh, out of shock. <laughs> you have to. September 17th. I yes. don't think I said that yet. So, yes, September 17th is when we will be showing The Greatest Showman, and you have to come, Judd. And that's at 7 p.m.? It that's is a Saturday? at 7 p.m., All right. Yes. Well, if y'all show up, you're probably going to see me there. I think this is an opportunity. And then <laughs> another one that I want to uh, see is everyone's favorite. Well, okay, my favorite redhead. We're talking Reva. That's right. So we. We have a legendary Las Vegas performer, Corey Sachs, who's coming to Liberty Hall on October 1st for Reba the Tribute. Once again, go to our Facebook so you can just see a picture of Corey. She looks just like Reba, and she is a five time winner for Las Vegas Performer of the Year. So she, we are very excited to see Corey Sachs performing as Reba on October 1st. And then speaking of redheads, I just got to go ahead and dive into this. All right. We have the three sisters, Hocus Pocus, coming up on October 22nd, which I know you and I I'm were ready. talking. I'm going to be there. You don't even have to question that That's one. That's <laughs> right. And we're really excited about this with the new movie coming oh, yes. out to be able to show the old one for family so that you can relive the classic with your kids because I know I grew up on Hocus Pocus. I'm sure you did too. Oh, yes. Yes. Well, I mean, it's just going to be perfect timing. You can go and see Hocus Pocus and then turn around and grab that Disney Plus subscription or borrow your friend's password. I didn't say that. <laughs> <laughs> and stream the brand new one. I mean, like That's you right. said, it's yes. just great timing. Um, so we got all these fun events lined out. If you missed it here, we'll get it listed for you on KETK.com. But where can we go for some more information right you now? Can Always go to the Liberty Hall Facebook, which I've said quite a bit yes. today, or you can check us out over on LibertyTyler.com. And well, that's just spelled LibertyTyler.com. And we have a calendar of our events where you can check out what we have coming up for the remainder of the year as well. Well, it is certainly a pretty good lineup y'all got going. Let's go over it one more time Elvis and the Beatles. Elvis and the Beatles, Greatest Showman, Reba the Tribute. Hocus Pocus, and then we've got the Rocky Horror Picture Shows coming up. We have the showing of the Halloween classic. Then getting into November, we got Penny and Sparrow. We got some more Elvis shows. Wow. We've got Christmas movies. There's a lot coming up at Liberty. Well, so it's exciting. Y'all head over to their website, check that out. I'm sure y'all will be back to talk more about Hopefully it. Hopefully so. Well, yes. Well, we appreciate you coming on as well, always. Well, thank you so much for having me. Absolutely. Well, you guys stick around. Cut up next on East Texas Live. If you're looking for a job, we may have the perfect fit for you. Our job. Board posting is coming up next.